so much is happening in this part of the world, but of course, in Europe, deals are being done as well. Dharmesh and Carve are going to take us through them. Uh, do you want to start, Carve? Yeah, look, I'll just start with uh, Mario Balotelli. You were just talking about Manchester City. Uh, he is on the move uh, again. He's again. joined again. Yeah, he's joined Swiss club uh, Sion. Uh, he is... why is it always him? Why is it? Oh, <laughs> oh, very good day. Look, I think it is. It's, it's his ninth. <laughs> All right, <Dom. laughs> It's his ninth club. Uh, in the past uh, decade, five different countries. Uh, he's still only 32 years old. Mario Balotelli, back in European football, playing for Swiss club Sion. Serginio uh, Dest, what have you got? Yeah, this is the one that was um, Manchester United were exploring the possibility of trying to sign him from Barcelona. Ex-Ajax player, played under Eric Ten Hag. But it would have needed a few dominoes to fall into place because they were prepared to allow Aaron wan to leave if they could bring someone else in. But with so little time left, they couldn't do both deals. And I think the deals that potentially they were getting for Aaron wan wasn't going to be enough for Manchester United to be able to fund a deal potentially for Dest. But he is getting a move. He is leaving Barcelona and he's close to a move. And it's a big one to AC Milan. So Serginio Dest potentially on his way to AC Milan before the deadline. Clivert. We spoke a lot oh, about him. This was, I mean, throughout the whole of this transfer window, Fulham was so close to signing Justin Clive, but they'd agreed everything. 9.5 million euro deal, it was worth 5 million euros initial payment, 4.5 million euros in add-ons to go from Roma to Fulham. But it didn't happen at the last minute simply because they could not get him a work permit. The, the appearances that he'd made for Nice, that was fine but he hadn't made any appearances for Roma so far this season. And one source has told me that potentially Roma hadn't even registered him because they wanted to get that deal done. So that didn't happen, but he is looking like he's going to get a deal done. And that is to Valencia because they don't have that problem where they have to have a governing body exemption like they do when a, cl uh, a player goes from European football into England and the Premier League. So it looks like Justin Clivert very close to a move to Valencia. What else is happening around Europe? Uh, we've spoken a lot about Barcelona this summer. They've been trying to force a lot of their players out. Uh, one player who has agreed to leave is Martin Brathwaite. Uh, now, he has agreed to terminate his contract. Uh, he is moving to Espanyol, all being well. He's also put up a message on social media. He's had a... Uh, a lot of stick from some Barcelona supporters. I couldn't myself see quite what he'd done wrong. Uh, his message says, it's been an honour to represent this club. I have always given my best. Another player at Barcelona, question marks about his future, Memphis Depay. We know he was offered to a lot of Premier League clubs. He was also close to a move to Juventus. Uh, nothing materialised. He has stayed at Barcelona. He's training with the Barcelona uh, first team squad.